do, see? This is wrong. She's not good. Chill pill. Call the temporary guardian. They're on their way, honey. You can't keep calling them. Okay, go to the website and click on accessories. Lily, please calm down. You're so lovely when you're calm. The website! Just be careful. I use this for my work. You're not going to let her get more stuff, are you? This is important to your sister. You know she's had trouble making friends. They got the new spray line. Okay, Mom, order. Order. Gee, I wonder why. Lily, we can't afford anything else. Finance it. Listen to her. Smart. Where are they? They're taking so long. Why don't you have her clean her room while she's waiting? Brandon, butt out. No, but I mean, don't you think it would be a good idea? Teach her some personal responsibility, you know, time management, impulse control. Enough. And on top of that, it would reassure me my family has not created a monster. There are no monsters in this family. temporary guardian. So, are you ready to meet her? <laughs> yes, please. Okay. Lily, I'd like you to meet Lily D. No! Like one wasn't enough? Happy, honey? You are the best daddy in the whole wide world. Aw, it makes it all worth it, doesn't it? Now, most of our lucky girls take the limo ride to the salon at the Really You Center, where each get their hair and nails done. We find it's the perfect way for the girls to get acquainted. Can I, please? Is that included? It's an extra, just $229, and that does include the framed photo pack. Say no more. Please, Daddy. I'd be the happiest girl in the world. Mom gets to come along. Well, only a kid once. Yes! We're going to the salon! Right this way. Oh. Lily D, we are going to have the best time ever. Lily, did you notice Lily D has something for you? <gasps> You'll never find a friend so true as the girl who's really you. <laughs> Thank you, Lily D. By the way, mm -hmm. we've been working with the telecommunications industry, Ooh. and next month, Lily D can get her own matching cell phone with a real phone number. Oh, oh I don't think so. Oh, well, I bet Daddy would get it for me. Mm -hmm. Ow! You're pulling my hair! <sighs> Try holding still, sweetie. Yes, please hold still. Out, dude. I hate dolls. I, I don't even like bobbleheads. I used to blow them up with M80s, but only because I didn't like them. You need dynamite for that thing. <laughs> Get out. Dad! What happened to you? You used to be cute. Uh, Dad! Okay, never mind. Thank you. <gasps> Did they bother you? Don't be scared, Lily D. It's just a storm. <sighs> Everything Lily D gets, I get one too. This is our workout outfit. Sometimes my Delaney and I do karaoke together. I'm getting a nightclub set for her. There's a real microphone and a spotlight. It's on back order. 
I might get a really huge doll for my birthday, but I don't think I can get the furniture and stuff. Oh. <laughs> that would be weird. <laughs> you know, Jess having the doll? <laughs> Gee, I don't know. I think maybe my grandparents would get that for me. They probably would. Really? I don't know. It just doesn't seem that they give you very much good stuff. What are you doing? Tabitha says that Lily D told her a secret. What secret? Tell me. It's a secret. Tell me. Mm -mm. This is my house, okay? And there are no secrets. Promise you won't tell anyone? Promise? Cross your heart? Yes. Hope to die? Yes. Stick a needle in your eye? Whatever, just tell me. Well, Tabitha says that Lily D says that Lily D doesn't like you. <laughs> Tabitha! Lily ripped her leg off! <laughs> Don't worry about it. These things happen. Wait, here, take this and get Rachel a new doll. No, no, no. Please. I can't. That Rachel is a liar. You didn't say that? That you don't like me? I love you too. <laughs> Something mean does not give you the right to destroy their things or hit them or anything like that. Don't you just love Lily D's hair? <laughs> Rachel's mother doesn't want Rachel coming over anymore. I don't care. I think you need a time out from Lily D. No! Yes! And that is final! For how long? That depends on you. Here is my guest, not Lily's. We need counseling, like yesterday. Daddy, can I please have Lily D back now? I promise I'll be good. No, let's say you be good for a week, then we'll talk. Honey, don't you think? No, final answer. It's Josh. She thinks the doll did it? Yeah, puppy's toast. You gotta trash it. If it was an accident, just say so, Lily. But I saw her. Her hand moved. Dude, she saw no, it. No, she, she didn't see it. Let me tell you what I see. I see two Lilies. One has done something very, very bad and is telling lies about it. No, I'm not. The other is sitting peacefully like a well-mannered young lady. Which Lily do you want to be? No. I saw her. 
Sal, go to your room. Right now! Everyone needs to calm down. Can I live with your family? You wouldn't like it. You wreck mom's computer. That was nuts. I didn't do it. I swear. Lily D did it. She. She doesn't like me. Forget it. It's not gonna work. I don't care if you believe me or not. Okay, it's true. She told Rachel she didn't like me and then she spilled the gravy. She wants to hurt me. She lied and now it's too humiliating for her to admit it. I'm sure it was an accident. Well, I'm glad you're sure, because I am not. But here's something I am sure about. If you hadn't spoiled her all these years, we wouldn't be having these problems. It's just hard for me to see her unhappy. That thing's not sleeping in the bed. Is it? Can, can I come in? Yeah. What? Um, I'm kind of worried about Lily. That's a new one. She, she really thinks that thing is like alive or something. Maybe we should just get rid of it. I think not. After all the money we've spent on her, we're not rich. Do you realize that, Brandon? Go to bed. Don't worry about Lily, she'll be fine. She'll work through this. I love this color on you. Lily's room. She doesn't like the doll. Yes, she does. Oh, yeah, right. The doll doesn't like her. Leave the parenting to me if you don't mind. Okay, no problem. Keep up the good work. Nothing gets past you, does it, Jill? I am making my famous French toast. We're gonna love it. Good morning, Princess. You sleep okay? Mm -mm. My neck is kind of stiff. Look up at the ceiling. Oh, it's not meningitis. Must have just slept, Bunny. So are you ready to apologize to your mom about the computer? I didn't do it. Henry Caldwell. Jack, hello. Yeah. Where's mine? Oh, did I not give you one? Jeez, Mom. Here you go, Lily. Sorry. You're giving the doll breakfast? Well, Lily D is no ordinary doll. You're totally obsessed with it. Her, not it. 
Mommy, does Lily like me? Well, she would if you would stop blaming her for things that you do. Maybe she did by accident. The meeting in Denver is on. I fly out tonight. When are you going to be home? Home for Sunday dinner. I'll miss you. Well, I'll miss you too, sweetheart, but if I can close this deal, we can all have life-size dolls. Oh, great. Well, you know what? Make mine look like Megan Fox. See you, Dad. All right, bye, sweetie. Brandon? Hey, uh, Mom's at some appointment. No, I'm just talking to my sister. Get that guy! Yeah. You, you, oh, come on! Get him! Sorry, I'm just... Hey, sister. I'm just talking to my Ten. sister. Where, yeah. where am I now? Oh, and Mom says you're still grounded with the doll, okay? No, no talking to my sister. Day. Oh, I made you nachos. They're in the kitchen. Just heat them up, all right? No, 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 no. Come, come on. on. Dude, they're in the kitchen. No, you. you the, the, the zombies are in the kitchen. He's his sister. Sorry, Lily. Love you. Lily D? I'm sorry I said you don't like me. Cause you do, right? Are you in here, Lily D? Lily D? Mom, take Lily D with her? How should I know? I can't find her. Well, she probably hit it. You're supposed to leave her alone. Come on. There's a flamethrower! No, I'm just talking to my sister. No, that's me, that's yeah. me! Come on, yeah. no, no, oh, you're the kitchen. kitchen. You're the kitchen. No, 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 no way, I'll get away. I told you, 10. You okay, Lily Pat? that on your hands? Have you been painting? No. Did Brandon tell you not to touch Lily D? How could I? You hit her. What are you talking about? She's sitting in the chair at my dressing table. No, she's not. She most certainly is. She's not. I checked. You checked? So you went into my room? Just a look. You done with those? Mom is on the warpath. Is she done with those? You should have stayed out of her room. Is there something wrong with them? No! No, no, she did it! There you go again. You are in very, very serious trouble. No, it's not fair. She did it! Stop it! She thinks the doll's alive. Stop it! She did it, okay? I know that she did it! Dude, do you think the doll's alive? No. And I'm gonna prove it. The following program is rated TV PG. Some scenes may be too scary for children under seven. We suggest watching together as a family. Previously on The Haunting Hour. You must be Lily. I'd like you to meet Lily D. Do you think the doll's alive? No. I think you need a timeout from Lily D. <gasps> Lily! You are in very, 
very, very serious trouble. No, it's not fair. She did it. You just admit you painted the wall in Mom's room. Because I did it. Look, nobody's gonna do anything to you, okay? I mean, you're probably just gonna have to go talk to a therapist. And they'll have candy in the office and stuff like that. I didn't do it. All right, just please stop crying. Lily really did it. When I can prove to you that Lily D can't move, you better stop acting like you're all innocent. You shouldn't be doing this in front of her. You're supposed to be watching for mom's car. Go watch for mom. into my room and filmed me on a hidden camera? You are missing the point. The memory card was gone. No, you're missing the point. Children don't hide cameras in their parents' rooms or anywhere else for that matter. Did you take the card? Give me that camera. Now. Okay, now. Okay, fine, but I know there was a card in there. I don't feel good. Can you believe what I have to put up with? Why are you talking to a doll? It's a doll. I mean, you've been acting really weird. I'm sorry, but ever since this doll has come into this house, our whole family has been falling apart. Jeez. You are right? <sighs> Mom, you, you, you've got to get her to a doctor. The doll took the memory card? We don't know that for sure. I knew it was an evil doll. Okay, hurry up, come on in. I'll have my mom to Lily to the hospital. I don't know when she'll be back. Do you think the doll did it? Maybe there's a computer chip inside of it. Maybe somebody's operating it by remote control. The Chinese government. There's got to be an explanation. Then what are we going to do? Take it apart. Alan Rich? But to see your neck is stiff? Yeah. Sometimes a stiff neck comes with a virus. Has she always had this? That's a birthmark. Okay, can I get the light? Yeah. Careful. She looks a little dehydrated. Is she getting enough water? I think so. We've been having some behavior problems. Mm hmm Don't like to hear that. It. Nothing major. Her eyes do look a little glassy. No chip? I don't see anything. Hold this. Any pain? Just kind of hurt all over. Yeah, okay. It's hollow. Let me see the head again. You're wimping out on me, dude. See what's under the hair. Okay. 
99 percent. It's just a virus, and she'll be fine in a day or two. But we'll take some blood, and I'll prescribe an antibiotic, just in case it's bacterial. Okay. In the meantime, young lady, stay home, rest, watch TV, play with your dolls, if you like dolls. <laughs> okay. Let's check it out. Something's been painted over. There's, there's writing. That's a D. A D for doll. Or a lily D. Hang on, there's, there's more. Destroy this doll. Oh, man. Stay. Close. There's no way. You should search up M for messed up dolls. Over here. What if they're all evil? Like a, like a gang, like a gang of evil dolls doing hand signals and stuff. sold my business to them. Your business? Yes, my business. I'm the doll maker. For years I made my dolls. Right here, in this very room, beneath my house. And my greedy husband, may he rot in his grave, talked me into selling. And then your company tore down my house. And they built and they built and they built. Then came the orders. Make more dolls, faster, 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 faster. Money, 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 money. What have I done? What have I done? I should saw your neck. No, 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 no. We are not with the company. We are not? I, I don't even shave. We are customers. My sister bought a custom deluxe doll, and we think it may have come alive. Yes. Look, that's the doll. Oh, no, 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 she was supposed to have been destroyed. Right. Destroy this doll was written on the back of her head. But, um, it was painted over? Painted over? Scum! I warned them I was going to destroy her myself, but they said, no, 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 they would do it. Get back to work. They promised they would destroy her. They promised. Liars! 
They didn't believe me. They must think I'm insane. Can you imagine it? <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with the doll? Her soul. Her soul? All the dolls have souls. Oh, yes. Some are silly, and some are shy, and some are very serious, but they are all good. All the dolls have one thing in common. They are content to be who they are. But that one, she was different. She didn't want to be a doll. So what's going to happen? No telling. But it won't be good. Go. Destroy her. Go. Okay, I'm, I'm trying. Window! Destroy her! She's a bad girl. Absolutely, she should see a therapist. Talk to your father. Hi, Daddy. Oh, this house is a mess. You mean like a counselor? The one at school? Well, then who? Yeah, I guess. I love you, too. Mommy? I'm gonna try to be a nicer person. And I'm gonna try really hard. I'm glad to hear that, sweetie. I'm going to go into your room and lie down. you were my daughter. evening. A mother can like a doll, but she can't love it. And a mother will always love her child, but she can stop liking it. So now that mom will think I'm you, she already love me. Then, all I need to do is make her like me. Goodbye, Lily. I always hated you. You all right? I feel so much better. Where's the doll? Hello. You boys clean the kitchen and fold the laundry? I did, Mommy. And look, I made you a little snack. A little sandwich and a cappuccino. <laughs> Hi, 
I should have been on top of the world about closing the deal. But all I could do was worry about Lily. Then I walk through the door and everything's right again. It's incredible how fast kids can turn around. Weird is more like it. Can I help you, honey? No, Daddy. You've been working hard. You deserve special treatment. Incredible. <laughs> Something is wrong. Don't start in about that old lady again. Nothing's wrong, Brandon. Something happened to me. I've changed. It's a good change. Do you like me now, Mommy? How could I not? I think Lily D deserves some new presents. Oh. No, Daddy. I'm through with dolls. So what did that doll do to you? What do you mean? You're lying about something. I can tell. I don't know what you're talking about. Yes, you do. Maybe. You're just not used to me being the good Lily. You don't want me to be the bad Lily again, do you? <laughs> of course you don't. Good to be you. <laughs> you guys better get going. You smell different. Oh, well, not bad, I hope. <laughs> no, just, just different. Do you love me, Mommy? Better get going, you're gonna be late. Here to see the dog get trashed. Hey, Mom, this wasn't here before. Lily's birthmark? How can that be? We gave them a photo of Lily's face and her measurements, but they didn't know anything about a birthmark. Exactly. Hey! Come here! Stop her. That's not Lily. This is... Whatever you do, do not let the trash take her. Okay? And her scent? And her birthmark? Is it that impossible? Henry, this is our Lily. What? This is our Lily and she's gone. Oh, my baby. I love you so much.
too bad. You always get what you want. Yes, I do. Just a doll. I thought it was a real girl. Me too. Huh. Wicked. Just a doll. It's still not right. Oh, poor thing. Wait till we drop her off Todd's roof. <laughs> no, don't. If you do that, you'll kill her. Kid, you can't kill a doll. Just don't, please. Look, okay, it's okay. We're not gonna drop her off a roof. Who says? Me. You want it? Really? No way. Shut up, Mike. I found it. I mean it. Shut up. Who cares? Take it. Thanks. Come in. This is a new friend. Isn't she sweet? Some boys found her and gave her to me. But first, they tortured her. A torture victim, huh? Well, that wasn't very nice of them. I know, it was terrible. But we'll be nice. I've never seen a doll like this. I've seen them on TV. It's a Really You doll. Oh, yeah. Custom made by Really You for Lily D. Lily D. That must be her name. Lily D. At least it's not a stray dog. Or a litter of mice. Oh, remember the mice, Natalie? We found that dog a good home. Yeah, after some vet bills and some stains, we may never get out. Lily D's not going to make any stains. She's not going to be any trouble at all. Are you, Lily D? After I get you clean, Gramps is going to fix your arm. Maybe after that, he'll take me a good will, and we can get you a new outfit. Now, don't squirm, but I have to get every little part of you clean. Oh, gee, look what those boys did. It's so mean. Why would anybody want to be so mean to you? Dang, damn it. I think there's a part missing. I could bolt it together, but I... I doubt it would hold very long. The Really You Company has a doll hospital. As seen on TV. I know it's probably expensive. But I'll save up all my money. I'll sell lemonade. I tell you what. I'll try and scrape up the money to give proper medical attention to Lily D. And you'll sell lemonade and pay me back. Thank you, Grandpa. I love you. Good morning, my babies. <laughs> I hope you slept better than I did. Tossing and turning. Turning and tossing. That's me. 
I'm gonna sketch you ahead. Something has changed, my children. Can you feel it? Yes. Something has changed. Could it be? A miracle. I'll get it, Grandpa. You must be Natalie. Yeah. We're glad you could join us for dinner. So you're the one who fixed her arm? Yes, and I'm also the one who made her. At my workbench, you didn't need to bother. Oh, well, there's no bother at all. I love her new outfit. Mm, no extra charge. Mm, mm, good. Uh. Poor Lily Dee. Mm -hmm. She's been through a lot. Mm. When I found her, she was all beat up. Mm. I fixed the doll's arm, but it was your child's love that fixed the doll's heart. Mm. The doll has a heart? Yes. And a soul as well. Mm. There was a time when Lily Dee wasn't content to be a doll. Is that right? Yes, sir. She was a regular hellraiser, excuse my French. Vicious little thing. <laughs> but she's content now. She's she's at peace. She's happy to be a doll. Oh. Mm. Well, it's lucky for us. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. Well, I just love her. Yes. I can see that you do. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. But... Mm. 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 Be alert. If she misbehaves, call me. No, no, Natalie's a good girl. I meant the doll. Thing. Must have fallen from your nest. Look, Lily Dee, look what I found. A baby bird. Isn't she just the most adorable little creature? I'm gonna nurse her and be her mama. Now you just stay right here. Lily Dee will look after you. I'm gonna go tell Grandpa. You're not jealous, are you, Lily Dee? Good. I knew you wouldn't be. Because you're a good girl.
What happened? I don't know. Some stuff fell off the bookcase. How? I don't know. I was asleep. Are you okay? I think she's okay. No, that's just strange. Things don't fall down by themselves. How did the doll get on the floor? She was in bed with me. Maybe when I jumped, she fell off. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Look at you fluttering your eyes at me. Yes, you like that color better, don't you? I can see you're flashing your eyes at me. Why is we done? What? What? You put the child in danger. No, oh, no, no, no. Don't be silly. The, the child's love has calmed the doll. Has it? It goes back. Back to the bone. To the bone. Bad through and through. Through and through. Destroy the doll. Destroy the doll. Save the girl. It'll be your fault. Your fault. Destroy the doll. Destroy the doll. Save the girl. 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 It's okay. I'll look after you. You'll be just fine. You're my baby. That's what you are. Hey, come on down. I have a present for you. What is it? <laughs> come on down, see for yourself. You can come too. I'll be right back. I was chatting with Mrs. Alvarez next door, and I mentioned your bird, and she was kind enough to give us this cage from her garage. It's perfect. So somehow this fishbowl fell out the window onto the doll maker lady. Well, I don't know. It must have. The fishbowl was in this room. And you and your granddaughter were downstairs? Yes, I told you. Was the fishbowl on the windowsill? Oh, not usually. Natalie, was the fishbowl on the windowsill? I don't think so. Hmm. Is there anyone else in the house? Hmm? Just Lily G. <laughs> it's a doll. Well, we'll see what the old lady says when she regains consciousness. If you don't mind, I'll hold on to this. Mm. Here, I'll help you. Thanks, honey. Thank you, sweetheart. You can give that sauce a stir, too. Are you okay, sweetheart? The lady will be okay. You know, they'll fix her up at the hospital, just like she fixed up your doll. Which reminds me, where is Lily Dee? I left it upstairs. Cliff, I don't like it anymore. Now she's an it. Since when? Remember when that doll maker said that Lily Dee used to be bad? Oh, she was just being near yeah, fanciful. Can you just please get rid of it? Of course we can, if it's upsetting you. I'll go get it. We can put it in the trash. Sure you didn't leave the doll someplace else? I know I didn't. Well, I've looked in my room as best I can. Pick up your things and let's get some sleep. 
The doll will turn up. That's what I'm afraid of. Grandpa? Grandpa, are you taking a bath? Uh, Natalie? What is it? Natalie, where are you? Grandpa! At least he tried to drown the baby bird. Is the doll in there? No, I don't know where it is. How did the lift get downstairs? It must have taken it downstairs. Where's my other chair? I bet it moved it. It's so evil. I'll go send the lift up. Natalie, a doll can't come to life. This one did. I know it, Grandpa. Natalie, wait. Three. 
sunscreen.